you notice if you if you look behind the plane, there's an island with like a castle on it. Uh, I just see green gas. Well, it's hard to see now, but if you look past the green gas, like southwest 207, mm -hmm. 208, you'll see it. Rohan. I found myself having to like fight the brainwashing a little bit of like when it comes to unions and and you know well at some point like they've got to be reasonable but like we've been brainwashed to, to think that it's reasonable to expect companies to pour billions into stock buybacks and bonuses mm -hmm. and then complain about not having cash to pay employees right i think it's just the hypocrisy because ryan's first argument is always well brandon the more money companies make the more they can you know Spend on the company and employees. Somebody else coming, oh, Brad? Dude, look, th this is insane. I don't even have I a count, gun. I count twelve people over here. How? Start that bounty. Let's get out of here. Dude, oh, that makes me mad. Yeah, dude. Let someone kill them. Let's just go. Let's go to the um. Right here. That's where I'm going. Like, I don't get it. Where can we go? Hey, I downed somebody. Nice. Oh, you know, a whole team running right here. Hold oh, on. This is annoying, dude. I'm coming. This is the La Brea Tar Pits. Look at this mess. Mm -mm -mm. I wonder if you set this on fire if it'll erupt. I'm not going to do it now because there's so many people near us, but... I guarantee Dude, you there's people fly here. You're flying. Yeah, there's people here. Dude, this is this is so upsetting. So upsetting. Because I just don't know. Where are they at? Right here. I have a pistol. Come on, dude. I'm, he's on a four wheeler now here. Was that you? Yeah, it was. You need a gun? Nope, Here. I got one. I got one. Okay. Like, I, I want to ask the developers, like, do they do that on purpose? Like, how do you construct a map in such a way to where people immediately... Like like no what matter where we like, jump, like, yeah. Where where do we jump? Like, I'm not gonna count one, two, three, four, five, six. There's like 20 locations on the map. So, if there's 200 people jumping, that means technically, per average, there might be 10 people in any one location. But again, these locations are huge. Rohan Ola is a huge area. Like, I don't understand how jump after jump after jump, we're running into multiple teams. That doesn't make sense to me. Where we roll? Okay, there we go. Like, this place should be so big, it should be hard to find somebody unless you just follow a giant crowd. Yep. Because that was one thing about Verdansk, because, like, you could always... There we go. You could pretty much count on most people going to a certain quadrant yes. and... Then People flocked to downtown. They like that. That's why you and I love the storage gulag. area. They used to go to. We love the gulag because it, you know, there was a 50-50 chance nobody was going there. You could get weapons, contracts, and then go join the fight. Now, what do you think that game looks like right now, dude? What's the player base for it? For what? Modern Warfare One and Verdansk and all oh. that stuff. Well, Verdansk is gone, dude. It's not back. I thought they. I thought they were gonna keep it up. You're talking about well, Caldera. not Verdansk. You know what? You know what I mean, Caldera. Oh, I don't know, man. I, I really don't. People yeah, over here, by the way. Over here, they've been here. Somebody's shooting.
Hey, get that gun. I already have. Oh, okay. I'll get it then. Alright, back out the way we came. Um, dude, I don't know. You want to go uh, here? We've never been up here. Okay, let's do it. Top of the cliff. Let's see if we can sneak up here. Doubtful. What if there's anything up here? Yeah, there's buildings. Oh, and the core is over here, too, remember? But we'll yeah. hit this place up first as a vehicle. Uh, bad guys. I mean, they're... I see them. They're way... Barely. They're by the railroad tracks. We good. I don't think I've ever been up here, dude. Me neither. I was listening to my Packers podcast today, and the guys were <laughs> talking, and they're like, man, I'm really concerned that Joe Barry won't get fired because Matt LaFleur has been so, you know. Is he a loyal guy? Very loyal, for one, and... Oh, yeah, people have been here. That's fine. That means they should be gone. Um, he's loyal to a fault. Like, literally. Doesn't matter how good or bad you're playing, he's going to blame himself. But that also means he's not honest. That's 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 one thing about NFL GMs, coaches, they're liars. They're, they're not honest about anything. The only time they're honest is at the very beginning of the offseason when they have to make roster cuts or coaching changes. That's when they're honest. They can lie all they want, but push comes to shove, once the season's over, they're going to make their changes. Frag, lethal, yes, I want that. I don't want that. But I say all that to say that um, Matt LaFleur, he might be that loyal of a guy to where he'll retain someone even if they don't deserve to keep their job. Look at all this freaking money I just got. Bad? Look at this. What? Dude, look at all this money I have. I got 15 Gs. Nice. Uh, where's the buy station, Brett? Let's get this car and go buy something. Okay. Oh, buy station at the quarry. Okay. But is your is your defense that bad? Oh yeah, they're ranked uh, 22nd in points and 18th in yards, I think. They're very bad. Guess how many first round picks they have playing on this defense? Uh, I don't know how many. Seven. <laughs> they're out of the 11 players on defense. Seven of them are first round picks. Kevin's like, see, y'all got rid of me, and you're garbage. <laughs> I was like, hey, don't blame me. I was only a second rounder. All right, there could be somebody. Hey, we here. got 30 seconds for this gas. Thank you. Buy any munitions box. There's a revive pistol if you want it. Pretty good. Let's go. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and pop this. It's it. We gotta go, Brett. We gotta get this okay. car right now. Did you get ammo? I did. I'm good. Oh lord. We're good. We're here. Go. Close. I'm not, not making that same mistake. 
Now it's kind of like trying to wreck the car. It's intel if you want. Sure. Why is that munitions box in red over there? I don't understand that. Oh, is that an enemy munitions box? I didn't tag a munitions box though. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Know. That's that's a glitch, dude. That's okay. Gotta whatever. Be. This is gonna be dangerous. I know there's people over here looking at us. I can feel their eyes on us. <laughs> Just act normal. We ain't doing nothing wrong. We ain't antagonizing nobody. <laughs> uh oh. What? You you don't want to do the intel? No. You just knocked a mirror off. That's hilarious. We're gonna bail and get out of this building, okay? Right okay. here, these double doors. Go. I love how in sync we are. We shut doors. We're probably the only guys that do that. Been burned one too many times. There's a medium backpack over here if you want it. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I've already got a medium backpack, I think. Okay. I don't. What I don't have is armor. Plates. Ooh. Get it. Next one's mine. <laughs> Alright, is there enough stairs to this building? Yep. Hey, plates here. Where? On the floor. Oh, I gotcha. We can take the elevator or we can take the stairs? Yeah, let's take the stairs. Why does it keep tagging things in red, like that gas Enemy station? I don't know. Armor box. Oh, I don't want that armor box because I got a munitions box. Where's the stairs at, Brett? Back here. I don't know if this goes anywhere. So the big building that we always like is right there. People have been over here. Elevator's right here. Alright, let's take the elevator. You ready to roll? Ugh, I do not want that. Slide <laughs> Oh, jeez. Oh, 